And we're back. Let's hang out with Nanako to continue our day. Actually, let's grab a bite to eat first. Short cake. Why not? Probably Nanako is man am I ever evil. Mwahaha. It was good though. I feel good. And my clothes are tighter. That's what I get for eating a little girl's cake. Um. Let us hang out, Nanako. Gosh darn it! She left us out in the rain again! Excuse me! Hmm, yeah now too! Do you have time after school today? Hmm? Did something happen? No. Rather, I'd like to have a doctor examine Teddy. It might be a good idea. He's not necessarily of this world. A doctor? You mean a vet? It's funny because he's a bear. The normal kind, actually. If you're free, I've scheduled a checkup for him after school today. A thorough physical examination might be a good first step in figuring out what Teddy is. It's a good idea to say the least. I thought it might be a good idea for the rest of us to get checkups as well. That isn't a bad idea either. We should see if the fog over there or the power we've gained have had any negative effects on our health. Since you all have been active on the other side far longer than I have, you should definitely be examined. Negative effects? D don't Drop scary stuff on us like it's nothing. Oh, calm down, Yosuke. It's okay. We've been through worse. But, yeah, I never even thought about that. I've arranged to have Kanji-kun and Rise-san looked at as well. Wow, you're on the ball about all this. Are, are you sure you're not an adult? Her height's a big giveaway, though. Oh, Yosuke, you ass. Well... I'll see you all after school. Look what you did. You made now to all pouty. Luckily, just Yosuke. She'll recover. That was just an ordinary checkup. I was kind of looking forward to getting into some gigantic machine and being spun around. <laughs> oh my god, I expected them to be normal checkups. Was there really a point to this? The doctors look confused too. Oh, they're back. I'm very sorry for the wait. I'm very sorry for the wait. So did they find out anything about Teddy? They did indeed. They found out that they can't tell anything about him. Wonderful. I even had them take an x-ray, but nothing came up on it. No matter how many times they tried, it would always be too blurry to read. A visual examination and standard palpations indicated that he seems perfectly normal. At least it doesn't seem that he's gonna die on us then. Since the machine could be malfunctioning, they told me to try another hospital if we're still worried about him. I felt bad for making them go through all this. So he is different. Oh my, what should I do? They took a look at everything inside me. She <laughs> just said they couldn't see anything on the x-ray you'd work. Oh my gosh. But at least they didn't find anything wrong with them, right? Hey, Kanji's following my thinking. Man, we know as much about Teddy as we do those personas and shadows. Oh yeah, I tried looking them up at the library and on the net. Persona means something like another personality. And I think they listed shadow under the related terms. Shadows are shadows. I think there's something that comes out of people. Well, shadows do literally follow you. I can't really explain. 
I performed my own research after the incident. Persona and shadow are common psychological terms. But wait for it. Of course, the ones we are familiar with don't quite fit those definitions. This is what was written in an unofficial yeah, exactly. project document that I happened to come across. A shadow is suppressed power, and when controlled by one's ego, it becomes a persona. I have a feeling that's some info left over from the last game from a certain group, if you know what I mean. It becomes a persona? What does that mean? They're, they're basically the same thing? Well, one's on a rampage and one isn't. That's the only difference. Well, then again, all those shadows we beat the shit out of did turn into personas. Who cares about the details? It doesn't matter what they are. They get in our way, I'll crush them. I like that reasoning. Kanji's got her back. Still, I couldn't find any information on how they're related to the other world. <sighs> There's so much stuff about us that we don't have a clue about. There's some things we do know, though. Mm hmm I got a bunch of awesome data with me. It's kind of embarrassing that I'm the only one who had personal details shown to the world, so... Huh? What? Ta-da! Oh, he didn't. Nowadays, information wants to be free. He didn't. Therefore, I'll break the ice by announcing the results of everyone's physical exams. He did. What? No, no, you won't. Give him to me now. Unless Teddy wants to die, I think you should listen to the girl. No. Nope. First place in the shortest legs division is... Huh, who would have guessed? Oh, God. It's not me, is it? Hey, what kind of things did they examine anyway? Look. If you're gonna blab it all, you might as well tell us the girl's measurements. So. Oh. What? Are you a complete and utter moron? And the anger shifted to Yosuke. Sure, go right ahead. My profile's been public knowledge for ages. Well, she is an idol. Oh, but my bus size is two centimeters smaller than they print. My agency insisted. Ah, that's kind of funny. I wouldn't put it under them. Oh, don't say mine! Aw, I bet guys won't care what size you are, senpai. And having modestly sized breasts like yours would definitely make it easier to wear a kimono. Is that an insult or a compliment? Maybe a bit of both. What? Oh yeah, Naoto-kun's in here too, huh? Um, let's see. Naoto-kun's is... Huh? Is this... for real? Wait, isn't this measured wrong? Oh jeez, how big are they? Uh, anyways... If they're as big as we think, that's gotta hurt. Ouch. The important thing is that according to the examination results, nothing's wrong with our health. So we won't be needing these anymore. I'm going to go shred them. <laughs> yeah, before anything else is revealed. Uh, well, thank goodness everyone's healthy. And that's the goal of what we were trying to do. <laughs> Not to get everyone's measurements. Uh, you're right! Let's go home! After all that, they found out nothing about me. I wonder what I really am. Aw, oh, Teddy. Cheer up. We'll find it out eventually. Oh, yeah. buddy. Thanks, Sensei. Feels good to have someone gaze at you with gratitude. Rank 6, how wonderful. It sucks that he's one of the social things that rank up as the game goes on. Hey! If you don't hurry, we're gonna leave you guys behind! Hold that thought, we don't want to be left behind. As I was saying, it really does suck because it'd be awesome to learn more about him at our leisure instead of having to wait on the game. Oh, welcome back! Oh, don't remind me, game. Midterms, yuck. Hey, Dojima. Hey! Wanna hang out? You can make us coffee. Ah, uh, 
I know you like making the coffee. Darn it. We'll just have to settle the talk then. It's raining. It's boring. Good morning, Naoto. Ah, stop reminding me. Oh, well, our knowledge is at stage level. We don't really need to study. Do, do, do. Ah, more reminders. <laughs> ah, you can pick me out. I am handsome. A no brainer. Maybe. And our knowledge has increased. Cha cha. Oh wait, we actually don't need that knowledge up, do we? Oh well. Of course. We'll go find someone to hang out with. Maybe Yumi's available. Yumi's always good. Yumi! Gosh darn it, Yumi, you're never here when I want to hang out. I guess we can try and go do another fox quest. Let's double check on that, actually. Da -da 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 -da. I think it's system and then quests. Wish our dog would return. Alright, guys, I'm gonna look for that dog. If I find him, I'll be back. If not, the usual. Oh, it looks like we couldn't find a little doggy. I guess we'll just work on these capsule machines. Yes. A pinwheel. I didn't want a pinwheel. Oh well. Oh, welcome back. Thank you, Nanako. How you doing? Can we hang out? We can. Is there anything nasty to eat in the fridge? Nothing. Nothing at all. <sighs> yes, Nanika, we will. I don't remember as to if we'll get a rag up today. Because I wasn't paying attention at the end of yesterday. And we will! Yes! Oh. I'll help you look for it. Did we find it? Please tell me we found it. It'll break my heart. And in the papers. A photo, oh no. Don't break your heart. Well, that's what it says. <laughs> oh. Oh. Always the harder questions you have to ask, Big Bro. He's lonely too. Oh, well, she's a little lonely herself. Ah, uh, uh, mini mo. There we go. Ha! After Mom died, I was lonely, but I'm not the only one who's sad that Mom's not here anymore. Dad, he was lonely too. I'm sorry, Dad. Oh! <laughs> 
She really is so grown up. Gosh. Am I the only one that kind of wants to cry after that little scene? Jeez. Thank you, big bro. You're welcome. Eventually he should. Good night. Good night. Oh wow. My heartstrings are just being yanked today. Hmm. What should I do today? That is a good question. Maybe we'll go at Aya and keep free juggling it, I guess, and see what we get. I'm actually kinda confused about Aya. I should have used it more. Anyways, let's head on out. Because it's not raining, there should be someone to hang out to. And I forgot to do my Tanaka deals. Wow, I'm incredibly sad now because I didn't save beforehand. Oh well, we'll make the best of today then. Just for missing out on those Tanaka deals. Hello? No one's here. That's the one thing I don't like about Persona 4, is like, if you go back to the house, it ends your day automatically. Ah, it's a dog! It snuck up on us, didn't it? Oh, don't bite me. Huh. Wow, it's wary of me. I guess I have to come back another day and talk to it. Mrs. Death is right there. But I think we should probably finish our social link off with Yosuke today. And that's what I aim to do. Let's go back into town and do so. And he's at the Juness department store as usual. I'm hoping so anyways. And he is! Haha, <laughs> hey Yosuke. Our social link rank I believe is... I thought it was 9, it is 8. Wow, that sure showed me, didn't it? Anyways, as soon as it stops giving us a list of personas, we will hang out with him. Okay, come on. Come on. And let's spend time, time with Yosuke. Come on, buddy, let's go hang out. Please rank up. Jeez, this tower... This, this hill, the view is beautiful. It is, isn't it? Oh, cheer up, man. <laughs> I want to tell Saki-senpai something. That what's important isn't where you are. Hmm. This town I hated so much, now I love it. There's still nothing here, but I have family and friends. And you. Ah, there you go, Yosuke. The important things are never far off. They're all around you. That's why I like small towns. It makes it easy to see the people you love. And the people you cherish. I always wanted to be special. I thought my life would finally have meaning if I was special to someone. That's why I was really excited when I got my persona. Because he became a magician. But I really didn't need it. It's not what you have or what you can do. Just being born, living your life. Before you know it, you're already special to someone. Hmm. That's true. Before you're born, you're usually special to your mother. I would agree with that. Yeah, like you. You're special to me, you know? Yeah, bro, I know. In this case, social link for me is a mixed bag, it seems. I'm really liking this part of it. Just like the 7 and 8 region. Or was it the 6 and 7 region kind of made me... <laughs> but oh well. Oh, too bad you're not my party man. That'd be cool. Maybe we can find Naoto's house. Oh, the funky roof. 
You know, mine's the one with the... I don't know. Dojima's roof. I don't know how to describe it. Plain. Oh, welcome home, big bro. Thank you, Nanako. Nothing again. Well, I'm gonna save and I'll be right back. Dojima. Hey. Would you like to make me coffee this time? Ah. Alrighty then. I really gotta start remembering to pay attention to the ends of the social links. Ah, yes! To rank up. Sounds like a plan. Here. Oh, what is it, man? Dojima? Coffee mug. A fitting gift for the end of the social link. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I won't. Dad. Uh. Let's go, big bro. Indeed. Did we give her, like, that little swinging thing where you grab her arms and you, like, swing her back and forth? Oh, no, it doesn't look like it. Be awesome. <laughs> uh. That'd be a great idea. Fish might be sleeping. Oh wow. Yeah. If she falls in, it's not a very deep river. Luckily, it doesn't look to have a current. Or much of one. And that's uh, a good reason, I guess. It's better than pursuing it your whole life. Well, with the unhealthy, or in the unhealthy way he was doing it. No problem. This town is my town. It's the place where you and Nanako live. That's why I'm gonna live on, protecting this place. As a detective, as a father. It's good that he thinks or he's resolved now. Oh, I'm gonna miss Dojima's social link. I'm having a feeling that so many people judged him by his cover when they first met him like a bad parent and all sorts of other things. They really don't embrace it as much as they should. But this social link, I tell you, is great. I like it almost as much as Kanji's. That's my favorite social link so far. And she ate was pretty awesome too. Crap, I wonder if Naoto has one. Yes! Should probably check around for that. Kohairu, or Ko Koryu. I think that's how his name is. I called him Hokuto the Magic Dragon in the last game, so. Yeah. <laughs> What's wrong? What? Oh. <laughs> I will, Dojima. Leave it to me. Don't you know who I am? I'm Detective Dojima of the Inaba PD, feared by punks and thugs citywide. Is it just me, or did, he, did that him saying his own name sound funny? 
<laughs> Whatever, okay. Well, I'll ignore that. See you later, Dojima. <laughs> uh, Dad's a pretty cool guy. Indeed. Hey, late night snacks? She's talking my language. Look how snazzy I'm dressed. Health and sports day. These are some awesome, awesome vacation days we're getting. The holiday names are weird too. And again, I don't know a lot about Japan. Be cool to learn. Probably should sometime. Anyways, let's go on out, because Nanako's got the house watched for us. Do 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 do. Maybe we can find Naoto. That may be something to do. We didn't find Naoto, but we found that dog we've been looking for. What should I do? Talk to it gently. So it's less worry of me. But we're probably gonna have to do that a few times. Alrighty, dog. Oh, <laughs> looks like such an awesome dog, too. It's so cute. Almost as cute as Corgi. Anyways, let's go find Naoto like I was looking for before we got so... Pleasantly interrupted. That wasn't really unpleasant. Yo, skate buddy. Yo! Yeah. We gotta get your social link finished up. I've been sitting at eight for a while. Or nine now, but you get what I mean. And I expected as much. Spend some time with Yosuke, but I didn't see it saying that it's going to increase soon. Sadly, that means we'll have to do another... Oh, you're one of those uh, left out in the rain moments. Bag full of clams. Mm, no, clams! They're so good, though. <laughs> of course. I'm not allowed to eat clams. Game's just like, nope. Double check what we need here. We need to get some understanding, courage, and or diligence. I think I got books for that. Diligence we can get by, I believe, making letters. Or folding letters. I don't know what book I have, though. I hope it's not a knowledge book. Changing careers. Thoroughly as usual. That's ah, an understanding book. I do not need that. Crud. Oh well. It's not the worst thing I've done. I remember raising charm in the last game like four or five times when I didn't need it. <sighs> Morning, GA. Yeah. I don't need any help, but I can help you out if you want. <sighs> okay, GA, whatever you say. Oh, it's so foo. There's so few. I never got our name right. Bourbon Dynasty. <laughs> uh, France. I don't know who that is. I did do quite a bit of history, but we didn't learn too much into Franz and Lewis. Uh, was it his height? It's misaligned T for his weight. All of those seem equally rude. Is it his height? No, that's Napoleon. Crap. I know I was right. Okay, then. I thought Napoleon was a short one. Huh. Oh, yeah. Won't forget the review. 
Come here, no more knowledge. Give me courage, please. That's all I want at this point. Well, maybe a little bit of the other stuff would be nice, too. Also reminds me. Oh, hi, Nanako-chan. Hi, Teddy. Hey, yo. I think I now reach a requirement to start a new social link. Try that later. Hey, greetings to you. Greetings to you. Oh, gosh, don't copy, Teddy. Looks like you're having fun. Yo. Wow, everyone's here. So many people. <laughs> I love the way she says that. She's like, oh, that's a lot of people. Ha, huh. not used to that. Why did everyone come here? Mm, a study session. Exam study group. <sighs> Times like these, I'm jealous of Teddy. Come on now, let's start with proving the trigonometric identities. Oh god, I hate trig. Ugh, jumping straight into math. Um, she has the same mindset. Huzzah, but it needs to be done. Ours is the section on trig functions, right? The one where we find the area of a triangle given two sides and... Huh? You find the area of a triangle with... You know, that thing. Um... Based by height by two. <laughs> oh my god, Kanji. If you don't mind, shall I teach you? <sighs> oh, are you as smart as I thought? Could you, uh, lend me a hand, too? Oh, they don't look at the sage, Mr. Soji over there. Oh, um, I wouldn't know where to begin with second year's subjects. Yeah, you probably wouldn't. Ah, uh, what's up with that? Useless after all. He's <laughs> so mean. Don't call me useless. <laughs> I think I've figured out what buttons to push to get Naoto Kun riled up. Gosh, Yosuke is always such an ass. <laughs> you're pretty cute when you're angry. Oh my god. What, what are you talking about? That's it. I quit. This just ain't my thing. The hell with the exams. It's time for my animal crackers. <laughs> yes, Ganji. All the animal crackers. Oh, can I have some too? I want to find the penguin. <laughs> Rize. Hands off the penguin! It's mine! Yeah, Kanji won't, won't let you have the penguin. Uh, forget it. I can't think. Teddy says he doesn't know who he is. <laughs> That's so weird. <laughs> she doesn't know the half of it. My life on this side is really fun. But the more I feel that way, the more I want to know who I really am. I've surfed the net, read manga, watched TV. I can tell you what Teddy is, and that's fabulous. I even went to a place called the Library, but I still can't find anything about me. Well, Teddy is pretty utter, otherworldly and unique. Dude, I'd be surprised if you did. Still, I'm starting to get an idea. Hmm? An idea? Whoa, isn't this your first time sharing a theory about yourself? I lived in that other world. That world was my reality. But now, I have a feeling that it was born from the minds of people on this side. That would answer a lot. And over in that place filled with shadows, I think I was some sort of special being. A special being? I don't remember anything from back then, though. Maybe it's that amnesia thing I read about in a book the other day. That explains even more. It's true. There are some aspects of the other world that make it seem as though it's rooted in human thoughts. Still, there's no point in applying the principles of logic and deduction to a place like that. But the fact that you existed in such a world from the beginning adds credibility to your theory. There is little doubt that you are a special being on the other side. If you yourself know nothing about it, perhaps it's true that part of your memory is missing. Tell me, what is the earliest memory you can call to mind? It's from a while ago. 
I've always lived there, as far as I could tell. Then it started to get noisy. So when I happened to bump into Sensei and Yosuke, I asked them to do something about it. I see. If you've always been on that side, you'd have no sense of time or days. Oops, that, that's right. Nanako-chan's completely clueless about all this. Yeah, we shouldn't really be talking about this in front of Nanako. <laughs> I'm sorry, Nanako-chan. We didn't mean to leave you out. Hey! I think Teddy must be a king. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, he has the hair. I read in a story that a king was all alone inside a forest because of a bad guy's curse. Hey. Isn't that what happened to you, Teddy? That could have happened. A king? Well, when you put it that way, it sounds about right. King of the bears, bearing it all. Teddy? A king? <laughs> I can see him wearing a cape! <laughs> oh god. Yukiko, don't get us all started on this. Sheesh, Yukiko. You go into laughing fits in front of anyone now. Can we not talk about Teddy being a king? Oh, the king's game, that's right. Crap, I can't believe I forgot. <laughs> huh? What's with that face? Teddy really was a king. There were all these other kings too, and we all... Hey, he's talking about what happened at the club. Shh. I just leave over to... You might want to be quiet. Then he'd probably keep going. Quiet, you! Not in front of Nanako-chan! <laughs> Am I really a king? Maybe. You never know. <laughs> if I'm a king, I'll get to smooch girls every day! Maybe I shouldn't have been nice to them. Gosh. I have this fuzzy feeling that I'll find out sooner or later with your help, Sensei. That pun. Ah, oh, that's daddy for ya. I wonder what some of those drinks are. It'd be cool to know. Has been enhanced. Severe ailments cannot be cured. Hey, bro! Teddy! Is melon soda okay? Melon soda sounds delicious. Good. Anyways, guys, that's the end of today's video. If you did enjoy the video, please do leave a like, maybe a comment, and subscribe to my channel if you yet to do so. Peace out, and have a great day, and I'll see you in the next part.